what is up it's your boy silos um it's been one week actually two weeks i've been getting a little lazy on making some of these videos and whatnot but i'm still continuing reading the mangas and comics that i have uh in my backlog but um today like you saw in the thumbnail we're gonna be going over the breaker volume number two and if you're interested in more content or more videos of mine then go ahead to my head over to my channel click on the videos and check out this video i'm looking at uh, or you're looking at in the background which is the blackest night and i'm doing a little comparisons with the green lantern omnibus volume number two which contains black is night one through eight and that's about it so stay tuned breaker volume number two let's go all right so before we get started on the breaker volume number two i want to show you guys what's going to be coming up next on my channel a couple of volume twos and one number four so stay tuned for the spreegan deluxe edition volume number two the overview for this one i haven't really gotten into this one but we'll get into this one real quick and also um Helsing volume number two. We're gonna be doing an overview on that one as well. So stay tuned for that one That's gonna be a nice overview deluxe edition, which is in a bigger size uh, page about the size of an omnibus and um, also stay tuned for uh, volume number two of the Superman and Batman containing issues volume 44 through 87 and annuals 3 and 5 and last but not least stay tuned for also the hellblazer volume number four that's gonna be coming also soon onto the channel i'm gonna be doing an overview on that one uh maybe sooner rather than later than these other ones but stay tuned for that one now enough said let's get back to the breaker overview all right so we're back finally 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 all right so i'm gonna try to do this with one hand my tripod just broke so you know how it is with manga it's really hard to keep them open you sort of need both hands but breaker volume two Story by Jeon Gyuk Jin, art part, uh, art by Park Jin Juan. It almost sounds like Juan, but it's Juan Juan. A Blaze manga, The Breaker. Uh, at this point, this one is collecting 16 through 29. So those are the chapters. 364 pages, volume two um so the teacher ended up getting into a fight and with one of the clan members and um this guy is learning how to control his power because they gave him a, a pill that they made called the moon pill which makes you stronger it makes you heal but if you don't know how to release the energy that that pill is giving you he can burst into flames and die right so he goes back to class and um this they're gonna start introducing new um new uh characters into this one as far as this guy right here He's the school janitor, um, but he, he drives a, a Lambo. How about that, right? So the teacher is wondering, or the principal of the school is wondering, how does this guy make so much money as a janitor to afford a Lambo? And, you know, um, these people don't know that some of the characters, as far as like the nurse, 
um, is in a clan that stole the pill, which is called the Moon Pill, which gives you abilities to heal, uh, increases your power, and a bunch of other stuff, right? It just makes you like a superhuman, right? And he doesn't know how to control his his power, so the teacher, the substitute teacher that got into a fight with the boss in the ending of the last manga, which we don't know what happens, uh, ends up reappearing here later on in the manga when they start introducing new bosses and stuff like that. So, um, the student starts getting all worked up because the school nurse doesn't let him know that she's absorbing all his chi. So he's getting all excited and all that. Like, what are you doing? Um, and he explains to her or she explains to him that he's supposed to relax. She's absorbing his chi. If not, something bad can happen, which is him burning up or bursting into flames. And this is how the pill looks like. Um, certain, I'm guessing clans uh, make their own pill to give them certain abilities. And this particular clan makes this pill called the moon pill. And everybody's after it for some odd reason. But these are the students and bullies that... Um, are always bullying this guy right here or this kid just like in the last one it still takes place like in the school some scenes and some scenes take place out and about in the street right and he's punching them and all this stuff and in the last one he made his hand bleed like that i don't know if you guys can remember from the volume one overview that i did um Make sure to hit the subscribe channel at this point, the likes, leave a comment. I'm doing this with one hand because my tripod broke, but we're going to see how far we can get. I might not even get to the end until it starts flipping by itself. But uh, here we go. The teacher reappeared as the uh, kid throws a punch, right? And... Mr. Han, like I said right there, I just, I'm remembering, trying to remember some of these guys' names. I'm watching anime, reading, like three mangas at a time, and my tripod broke, so bear with me, alright? Uh, one thing that I like is that this other kid, rich boy right here, that's uh, part of another clan, they all have their own, like, abilities, right? They have their own special move and all that stuff. But uh, he's testing the boy. So he tosses the keys up in the air. And as he throws the keys up in there as a distraction, he throws a punch at him just to test him out. But uh, homeboy's like hella fast, you know, and ends up somehow snatching the keys and blocking his punch or maneuvering away. And this girl right here, which is the nurse, Everybody likes her basically. Miss Bai, that's her name. Um, has the. Everybody likes her, you know, I guess she's like hot or whatever. And um, she she's a thief. She stole that pill that everybody's looking for. And somehow she gets confronted at a bar and all that stuff. But uh, so, then before I get to there, let me explain what happens here. These two guys came. To get the pill but they don't know that he had they had ministered the pill already to the the boy so the pill's gone right basically and these guys come in trying to beat him up but he's all scared and out of fear he literally beats them up to the point where he kills them with all that power he got so miss Bae comes in and looks and she just can't believe 
that that happened and then um he's all freaked out he like literally freaked out he he, does, he doesn't know he he didn't know he could do that and um teacher ends up coming through and um tells miss Baye that you know what do we do now and they gotta clean it up so they told the boy to go to the nurse's office and lay down and just chill out but he's remembering what happened right here and this they're showing you what happened and this is how they ended up the way they did right i like this uh scene right here with this panel it's like a top corner view panel and stuff And yeah, so, you know, they start meeting other people. Um, basically, that's it. You know, the story gets interesting. They start bumping into these. Uh, they have this scene where they bump into these motorcycle gang. Uh, that they all uh, or clan, you know, they name them. They, they call them clans, but in reality, they're just like gangs. And they all ride bikes on this one. And they're trying to get this one girl. Sorry, I'm trying to, can't do it with one hand, it's pretty hard. Uh, I'm trying to hold this book open. So they're being followed, they're trying to hide this one girl they're after for some odd reason. Uh, she has something they want, this guy, because he, uh, right before he got caught by this one guy, he kicks the door open, not knowing how hard he's, he kicked it, but he kicked it so hard because of that pill. He has superpowers, you know, every, uh, or his abilities change where he can run fast, he punches harder, he jumps high or whatever. And out of fearness or fear, he just took off. Look at his leg right here. He builds up all that muscle and just boom takes off right and they're all tripping out like what how's that possible and uh, yeah so man 10 minutes in trying to get this uh overview going right but let me switch up hands real quick all right so i switched up hands let's go <laughs> Let's keep flipping through. Um, he's trying to save this girl, which he ends up doing. They take her to an unknown location, gets uh, uh, chased by these guys. Mr. Han ends up reappearing out of nowhere and beats up these guys, senseless, right? So they want no part of them anymore. They're beat and they take off. Now they gotta go into hiding and as they're taking off, this guy won't give up. He wields the machete and almost gets them, right? But uh, these guys end up getting away somehow. His arm got chopped off. Mr. Han chopped it off with his own sword. Uh, and they don't know that this guy is part of a nine door dragon. Nine door dragon just means that he beat all nine tournaments and he's the world champ. So, none of these guys know that he's a nine-door dragon, which is the best of the best. And once they find out, they they basically shit their pants, right? She has a, a that girl right there. She has a necklace holding a pill. Um. And it unlocks something when you drink that pill, right? So every family has a different pill and has a different effect, which is pretty cool, right? But the main idea of this manga is just gangs in the underground world in Korea takes place. And if this kid doesn't meditate, he will explode from all his chi not being controlled right and 
they have to get away from all these gangs. Now they're on the run. Everybody knows that this kid or this girl stole the the pill, and everybody's after them. Gotta go in hiding. That's the main idea. Just uh, volume two. Don't know when I'm gonna get volume three. Um, also, I'm gonna be waiting for a new tripod. And that's it, you know? Action packed, $20 a book. 400 and almost 500 pages. And that's it. I'm gonna get part three. Stay tuned for the Helsing volume number two. And that's it, all right? So, if you guys understand how hard it is with no tripod, comment down below. But hit that subscribe, like, and I will come back with a, another video. Uh, I'm going to start trying to throw two videos a week instead of one. Sorry I lagged it. This one's about two weeks. Not in the making. I just was pretty busy. Stay safe, y'all. Peace.